Al Pacino. He has fame, fortune and a reputation that every young actor dreams of. A graduate of the Les Strasberg Method School of Acting, Al hit payload with his third film, The Legendary Godfather, in 1972. The role was his career-making hit, earning him the first of many Academy Award nominations. He then went on to star in such classic bad guy movies as Serpico, Dog Day Afternoon and Scarface. 20 years after his first nomination, Pacino finally took home an Oscar for his performance in Scent of a Woman in 1992. Known for his charismatic characters, Pacino still sees room to improve. Sometimes I've made choices in roles for really wrong reasons. Sometimes I did it, I did parts just to work. Um, to be actor, but I always tried to find a reason to do a movie. Al Pacino received a Life Achievement Award from the American Film Institute for the legacy of his great screen characters. From the tortured mob chief Michael Corleone to Tony Montana, a gangster who remains a cultural force 20 years after the release of Scarface. It means so many things. Uh, it, it, to be honored like this, you know, when I first heard about it about eight months ago, I was shocked and, and was, you know, moved and I just thought it was unbelievable. How, why me? Why him? Because he's Al Pacino. Mix it up.